Guys, how are we doing? Hope you're good. So welcome to uh, the Elite Movement Masterclass number one. Okay, today we're going to be looking basically at four pillars to build an unbreakable morning uh, mindset. Okay, if you are coming through, what I want you to do is a couple of things. Number one, let me know, hit the love heart button, let me know you're coming through. Number two, just comment that you're watching. And number three, I want you to ask a question, answer a question. And that question is, do you have a solid morning routine? Okay, so in the morning, or if you don't, why you feel that you don't. It's my aim in this video here just to give you a little insight into how you can develop and build a super solid morning routine using the four pillars, okay? Now, so some of my clients are already in the mastermind, in the brotherhood, will already know some of this, but it will be a good um, recap for some of them. For some of you who are thinking to come and join our next 90 day elite operator mindset, it will give you a little phase about what we're gonna be doing in phase one. So the reason that we're doing this is um, obviously next week we are launching our brand new 90 day elite movement and we're gonna be inviting men to come and join us on a process to go from here, from a place of chaos, a place of where we struggling to understand who we are, where we're struggling in terms of direction and lack of purpose. And I wanna take us from this point on this journey over 90 days, over two phases. Phase one is going over the back to basics 28 day process where we build the fundamentals, we follow a, a four pillar framework to get us back on uh, uh, on track, get us every, uh, to the place we need to be, that gives us uh, control and leadership of our own lives, all right, so that we can start managing ourselves to be the best version of ourselves for our families, for our jobs, for our personal development. And then we move on to the embedding phase, so making sure that becomes a lifestyle, all right? So, Today's is going to be focusing on unbreakable morning mindset. Now, the, re the way that we get guys here to get towards this end goal, to get away from this status to the status of an elite operator mentality. So it's a status, it's a stand, it's a mindset. It's something that we em employ in ourselves so that we m reach the mark each time. It's kind of like setting a base standard. And to get there, we've got to go through training. We've got to build up mindsets. We've got to do things differently. We've got to be accountable. We've got to be around like-minded men. We've got to make sure that we're finding direction along the way. Now, for me, over the years, that has been the morning routine, okay? That morning routine has been the thing that has guided me to having a strong, solid mindset to be in control of my emotions, mentality, physical shape, decision making, leadership to myself, to my family, so that I can be the best dad, the best husband, and I can run the, my career exactly how I want it to be. And that, that has evolved over the years. But what I've kind of come up with is a four pillars. And if we hit these four pillars, it's gonna allow us to tick these boxes that allow us to build this fundamental, this foundation, okay? And we run this in the mastermind. And this was a huge game changer when we introduced these four pillars to the mastermind because we went from just having a morning routine to then suddenly having structure. And these four, these four tick boxes, if you like, these four pillars, when we hit each one, they provide us a, a huge amount of consistency, a huge amount of control, and a huge amount of clarity about what we are trying to achieve in the morning. Now, um, I'm going to go through each one. I'm going to give you a quick example of how that can be done. And then we're going to look at how you can employ a morning routine to make sure it's consistent. So the first thing is first is um, mindset. Now, one of the things that I feel we really need to pay attention to is when we wake up and we are not in the most positive frame of mind. OK, as soon as that alarm set alarm goes, you have a decision to make either snooze or get up. Now, if you press snooze, that's your first loss of the day. Man, if you, if, you, if you want to start the day on a loss, you press snooze and you, you take in an extra 10 minutes in bed, knowing full well you're not really going to get back to sleep and you're going to be having pangs of guilt. That's going to stop you getting up, right? Or we can get up and we can own the day. And we usually sometimes wake up maybe in a negative mindset, not feeling great, feeling anxious. But what we want to do is make sure that we're here and we're getting that, I've missed the D of the mindset, mind set. Um, is getting into the mindset. So that is meditation, that is reflection, that is perspective, that is um, listening to a chapter of a book, that is doing poetry, whatever it is for you that really helps you connect your mindset to get your mind going, sparking it into life, 
all right? The second is activity. Now, this doesn't have to be your main workout. You don't have to get up in the morning and do your 20 minute hit session. You don't have to go to the gym. It can just be something to balance the chemicals and the way that you've woken up. Now, for me, that's a three and a half mile walk. And that allows me to have some perspective, do a lot of reflection and be really grateful about everything on that walk. And it really, if I'm, if I'm in a negative mindset, it allows me to balance that by the time I finish that walk. So it's about a 50 minute walk. And I can be in a place where I can think better, I'm in a better mood, I build up an upgradeable mindset, I understand exactly what's going on in my head, all right? So that activity could be something from yoga, it could be a walk around the block, it could be a 20 minute run, it could be a gym session, it could be 20 press ups, sit ups and squats, it could be anything you want it to be, but get the body moving, get the blood flowing through the brain. Gratitude, I think this is the anchor, right? This is the anchor for our, our perspective, so we don't fall into the victim mentality. We realize what we've got in our lives. We understand the things that we want in our lives. We understand the direction that we want to go. So we're really grateful for the journey that we're on and the journey that we're going to be on. So we're following that journey right throughout. And I think connecting that is what helps us avoid the victim mentality, the pity party, the overthinking. Gratitude is like the anchor. And then there's clarity. So clarity of what your journey is and what you're trying to achieve in your life. Clarity of what your day is and where your time and energy is going. Clarity of where you've come from. So you go through all of these sequences in your morning routine. And if we tick each one, it should, over a period of time, not should, it will, over a period of time, change the way that you show up from the morning. And this is what we're implementing in the mastermind right now in the brotherhood. This is, this is the mentality that we're trying to build from that morning so that we are in a great frame of mind. When we walk out that front door, man, we're ready for anything that comes our way. We are the leader of ourselves, we are the leader of our families, and we're the leader of our careers and personal development. And to build that unbreakable mindset from early on, Man, what a place to start from. Rather than waking up 15 minutes before you've got to go to work, looking for your keys, not having breakfast, feeling completely overwhelmed and unorganized, right? This is a place where we can start from to win. Now, if you are going to come and join, join us for the next 90 day elite movement, you are going to be heavily doing this in phase one here. And you're going to have an accountability system that we have from Monday through to Friday, where you show up before nine o'clock in the morning, you do your morning routine, you hit everything in your pillars, and then you share it with the group of men that's in there. And that is your way of ticking the box to go, man, I'm ready for the day. I prime myself. I've put the effort in. I'm ready to go. Let's get on with the day. And that, I find, has helped thousands of men that have come through this system, okay? Whether it's on the five-day challenge, the 28-day challenge, it doesn't matter what way they've come in, that morning routine has been bombers. It's been the, it's been the foundation for men to grow and build that state of mind. All right, guys, I'd love to know what your thoughts are on here. Give this a try tomorrow. And as part of your mindset, you might watch the Rise to Thrive show. So at half five tomorrow morning, I'm going to be back here on live doing my morning show. And that could be part of your morning routine. Okay, I'll try and get many guys to come into that to make that as part of their morning routine so that their mindset is in the right frame of mind. It gives them something to think about as well. Okay, so I'm going to be back here tomorrow night, um, roughly around 7.30 again. And we're going to focus on the next micro element that's going to help us on this journey here. If you want to come and join this, we don't have 10 places anymore. We have six places because uh, four places have gone from the priority list. But when those 10 places are gone, man, they're gone. And that's it until uh, March, guys. So if you want to come and be a part of this family, part of this community, a part of this movement, okay, um, there's a link on here somewhere. Go and check out the details. If you feel now is the right time to leave this person behind and start building identity and purpose and direction with a huge group of motivational men, with a group of men that are working on themselves, with me and my other coaches, then you can come and jump on board with us. All right, guys? So until tomorrow, until the Rise to Thrive show, uh, I will see you then. Make sure you're up. Make sure you're ready to go. You have the perfect setup to create a great morning routine and start the week differently. Start it strong. Be on that unbreakable mentality from the start. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your evening.